Hi, I'm Jana Rust, Director of Operations of the Women's Clinic of Kansas City. I'm here to tell you a little bit about Lifeguard Youth Development. It's a program of the Women's Clinic of Kansas City designed to prevent teen pregnancy. That's the bottom line. Uh, lifeguard came in and exposed them to, to the scenarios of those challenges in their lives and showed them how to make the right or correct choices. Uh, some of those things are abstinence from sex, uh, uh, the, the uh, drug issue with, you know, uh, should students use or not use, uh, the abuse and neglect things, uh, learning how to come forward and share and express. Um, and just to be open about those things, to, to talk about them so that we can identify kids to get them the help that they need. Uh, it's a must for our kids and our future. Um, I, I wish for my own kids and the kids that I have in school that um, they are given an opportunity to sit through a program like this because they will not learn how to address those issues unless programs like this exist. Also, the teachers, the teachers, I'd ask them, how's this lifeguard thing going on? And the teachers that were involved said, oh, they love it. This is great. We're getting a lot done here, more than we thought we did, because again, it was new to us. And we just weren't sure what was going to happen. But as it was happening, everybody was very pleased with it. I would guess it was because the kids were anxious to see lifeguard come in. They were ready to, to go to work and, and, and accomplish something, as opposed to going to another class, was, oh, hey, we're gonna do the same old thing and, and get this done. Again, as a social studies teacher, history teacher, boy, I was just focused on the classroom, what I had to, what I had to teach that day, get my objectives in, make sure those grades are going up. Make sure, well, there's more to it than that, and, this, and lifeguard life, uh, brings that to it. The top program definitely helped provide this situation um, that was better than anything I had ever created because the kids got to know each other on a different level. They shared personal stories, they started to be more tolerant of one another and just work together. And I told them about the program and I said that um, it's been a great way for me to get to know the students on a different level. So anytime you get to know your kids better, they're going to do better for you. They're going to perform better for you. It's going to matter to them if they did their homework because they don't want to, you know, disappoint. I can cover the curriculum so much faster. They work so much more efficiently together on group work, on projects. I would tell somebody that was considering donating to this program that it, you can't even put a price on it because you're talking about our future. You have goals, you have dreams. So, you know, any way I can help as a teacher, because I believe in you, lifeguard program believes in you, that's why they're here. We've heard it so many times that students, kids are our biggest investment. You cannot go wrong by investing in a program that believes in kids, a program that actually promotes sexual integrity, uh, they promote uh, character education, and you can't go wrong. And so those classes that did have it, man, those classes really, you found friendships in the classroom that you would never expect. Um, you found kids sharing things that were surprising to me, you know, um, that I didn't think a kid would share in front of all of their peers, but they were willing to share it. Um, so at some level, it starts at like the surface, right? But then as they get into topics, it goes, right, because it goes from puberty, then it really starts to talk about things like pregnancy and assault and bullying and all of this kind of stuff. That's really where those powerful stories come out and powerful relationships get built. Um, and so for me, I think that this program is so excellent for our students because it does address those issues that the typical curriculum is, is missing. And I think giving to this program and supporting this program really helps support a missing piece in Kansas City, making sure that these kids at the middle school level, that some of their toughest issues are addressed, that they learn really powerful skills, really powerful habits and ways of thinking and confidence and service and all of these awesome traits that we want to see in adults. Um, supporting this program means building those traits at the middle school level, which I think is a really powerful, powerful time to do that. Here's how you can help. Click on www.guardyourself.org and make a donation. A donation of any size will help us keep the program going in the Kansas City area. You can schedule us to speak at your next event regarding adolescent health and wellness issues. You can invite us to teach a youth development course at your church or at your school or at your community organization. And lastly, 
You can tell others about the work that we've done and the work that you've seen. Spread the word. The problems of today's youth and our culture don't have to be the way they are. You can change it. Thank you for your help.